Hi everybody, today I'm reviewing the St. Marie's Instant Self Tanning Mousse. I gave this product 2 out of 5 stars and I got it online on Amazon for $4.90 and it comes in a 6.76 ounce bottle. So that's extremely cheap, one of the cheapest self tanners I've ever seen. It works out to about 72 cents an ounce or something like that, so very cheap. And this product is a mousse. Um, so at applying it did become really, really messy. Um, make sure you shake it, give it a good shake before you apply it or else it comes out basically as water and it will get all over the place. Because it does come out with a really, really, really dark guide. And the guide is really dark brown, maybe almost a greenish gray color. I was a little frightened when I saw the color and putting it on was pretty difficult because with this product it comes out as a mousse you start putting it on and it dries extremely fast. So it kind of dried while I was putting it on and I didn't get a time, the time to fully blend it into my skin. So it dried and splotchy and streaky all over. I actually freaked out because I kind of looked like a zebra that rolled around in the mud. Um, I didn't like how I looked after. I, I don't really freak out most of the time because I know it'll wash off the next day, but this time I just looked so bad after I applied it, I did freak out a little bit. Um, but the next day after I showered it off, it did look better. Um, I did like the color after I, after I um, washed it off. It was a dark color. However, since the product dried so fast, my tan was still splotchy and streaky and I didn't like that at all. Um, so just be careful when putting this on. Make sure you wear gloves because it will stain your palms. and. It does get really messy, so just make sure you have towels down or something you don't mind staining um, if, you, if you do decide to use this product. And like I said, um, the color produced was dark and it lasted about three days, so that is about average. However, the splotchiness and the streakiness just didn't really cut it for me. Um, this product also has some ingredients that are chemicals that I, I'm not really a fan of. Um, I don't think men will like this product just because it's so messy and also it dries so fast so it leaves you streaky. So I would, I would steer clear, men clear of this product. The, and this product does smell um, like soap. I think it smells kind of like a cheap soap with a hint of DHA. I still smelled that the next day, um, but after I washed it off it did go away you know, completely. So I didn't smell anything after I washed it off, which was nice. Um, so for more information about this product as well as many others, Make sure you visit us on selftanning.com and on Facebook and Twitter.